All right, so I have two really great products from newer. We have a seven inch portable screen and a camera cage for your FX3 or FX30. And also um, I'm using them right now to film. So uh, yeah, let me just tell you all about it and quickly because it's Thursday. <laughs> So let's start with the seven inch field monitor. This thing is a really nice and thin, it's quality made, and it gives a quality resolution of 1280 by 800. So it's a really good monitor to preview your shots, making sure everything is framed correctly. And I must say like right now, uh, yeah, if I look up at it, it is so big, it's so perfect for framing it up. A lot of times on this camera that I'm currently using, the screen is so small, even if I tilt it out so I could see it, it's still really small and I'm out of frame. This actually helps out so much. It comes with a mini HDMI cable and a micro HDMI cable. It comes with an AV cable and a mini ball head to cold shoe mount. It also comes with a sunshade, which is really cool because you could put this thing on, that way if you're out in the sun, it will shade the monitor so you can see it easily. It takes a NP550 battery, but it also has a plug port on it. You have an HDMI input, AV input, headphone out so you can monitor the sound, OSD controller point, and a USB port for firmware updates. When you power it on, you can see that it looks really nice, but you can also adjust it a lot, even with four custom function buttons where you can get safe frames, focus assist, field check, and you can change the aspect ratios quickly. You can also flip the image and you can freeze frame the image. And when you're playing back a video from your camera, you can turn the volume up and you can hear it with the built-in speaker. It's a great field monitor, especially under $100. And that's not bad for how big this thing is. And I'll put links to everything down in the description so you can find it really easily down there. And uh, yeah, we're out of time for this one, but let's add another 30 seconds to the cage. If you have a Sony FX3 or FX30, this is a really great cage. It's lightweight, made out of anodized aluminum alloy, so it's resistant to corrosion, scratches, and impacts. They also have a lot of other cages for different cameras, in case you have something else. But for my FX30, it really does work perfectly. It's cut out so each compartment and button is easily accessible. When it's on your camera, it gives you a lot of options for like quarter thread mount points and the three eight mount points. There's a nano rail at the bottom. There's shoulder strap points, a cold shoe mount that's moved to the side, and there's also an HDMI cable clamp to keep it locked and secured. It's also equipped with the standard archetype base, which can easily get mounted on most ball heads and gimbals. If you are in need of a camera cage, make sure you check out Newer, and you can even currently pick this thing up right now and save 20%, making it under $65. And again, I'll put the link in the description. Oh, time's up. Thanks again for watching another 30 Second Thursday. Yeah, I'm using the products right now, which are just, they look really good. So I highly recommend it. And uh, stay tuned because a lot of cool gear is coming around and a lot of really cool stuff happening here at the new studio space. So stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Bye. Mr. Black.